today we'll be talking about the box office for Mario for as well. So we had tomorrow we're gonna have the Wednesday numbers, today's numbers for the rest of the world, but Aza has numbers already for Mario. Okay. It begins its first numbers tomorrow, the rest of the world. It'll expand to 70 through Friday. Well, we are numbers for a great number of the today's de- debuts, but early world hour of Asia Pacific is a currency at 8 million. Note that the full Wednesday number will be going out tomorrow as well. So that means this movie is doing better than the sequel of the pets and me and Survivor grew. It is in line with Aladdin and Incredibles 2 as well. Marion is predicting a 20 million finish in the market. These numbers can fluctuate as well. Australia gave Mario a 1.1 million. Again, Australia isn't a really populated place. There's only 24 million people in Australia. At 311 locations. This account for 62% of the market. First time growth is 5 times more than Zonic 2. Well, not Zonic 2. Zonic 4. The best opening day ever. For, and the best opening of the year. Best animated April star of all time. And above the standard Thursday open to Thursday opening days of Frozen 2, Incredibles 2, Finding Dory, The Jungle Book, Aladdin, Toy Story, and more than double of Minions. Yes, in Australia, Mario is defeating Disney movies and other higher year grossing animated movies such as Minions. Hong Kong kicked off its debut. It is above. Incredibles 2, Reds, and the Beauty and Beast, and Toy Story 4 in that country, making $700,000. And New Zealand got to 66000 k on Wednesday from 140 screens with 47% of the top 10. Second Vegas opening day of Illumination, where its opening for Thursday is Sing 2, above Minions and Minions, the Rise of Gru. So apparently, New Zealand loves uh, <laughs> Sing, but this is very, very good news. For the Mario movie. Okay. We're going to have to wait to see ne- tomorrow's numbers. As well. So for example. Incredibles 2. Made a billion dollars. Okay. This is how much money the Incredibles 2 made. And in most territories. Mario is defeating the Incredibles. Okay. Mario is defeating Frozen, Mario is defeating Aladdin, and also means the rise of Gru, obviously. Okay, and the first minions. Of course, you can adjust it for inflation. If it doesn't for inflation, and Incredibles probably does better than Mario. But we're not, I'm not going over to every market and adjusting it for inflation. As well. And it is the best for our world animation for five years. So Mario movie is going to be a big hit. It is going to be a big, massive hit at the box office. It is going to make a lot of money. Okay. Doesn't it, it seems that the critic scores are not affecting this movie whatsoever. Okay. It seems that the the Rotten Tomato score, which has never been trusted. Which is, and if this movie does make a billion dollars, this will be the ultimate slap in the face to Rotten Tomatoes. Okay. Because, for example, something like the Ryan King remake, Disney probably paid to give those movies the high, high scores in the 50s. Even though we all know they're complete garbage, dogs, and piles of movies. Okay, same with the Aladdin remake and Beauty and the Beast remake. They completely are, you know, city movies compared to the animation, animated counterparts. They, the fact that those movies, these movies exist alone disrespects the very animation sin. That we grew up with, you know, Beauty and the Beast, with, you know, Aladdin, you know, with, you know, Lion King, and Dumbo, and, and of course, Little Mermaid coming out, and of course, the Jungle Book, I actually like Jungle Book one, but again, the Jungle Book where I thought could work, probably could, all the movies could work in live action, but even then, the animated Jungle Book movie is still better than the live action one, I haven't seen it in a while, but I bet it probably is a better film, okay, but yeah. Overall, the Super Mario Brothers movie is going to make a lot of money, and there's nothing these people can do to stop 
the Mario movie for making money. Goodbye.